Hi everyone, and welcome to Science Fun for Everyone. I'm Scientist Joe, here with July's Experiment of the Month. This month, we are going ice fishing, and all you'll need to go ice fishing is some salt, some ice, and a piece of string. You may have heard of ice fishing before, that term may string a bell, but today we are not drilling holes in ice and looking for fish, instead we are going to go fishing for ice. Just start with, put your string onto a plate, and add a little bit of water. You don't need too much, just enough to cover the bottom of the plate. Then, put some ice cubes on your plate. Now, I'm going to take that string that's a little bit wet, and I'm going to put it across the ice cubes. I'm going to try to touch as many ice cubes as I can when I do this, because the more ice cubes I touch, the more ice cubes I can catch later. The next part is the most important part of the whole experiment. I'm going to take some salt and sprinkle it on my string everywhere where the string touches a piece of ice. I'm using a lid here to help me pour while I do this. And again, everywhere the string touches the ice, I'm going to try to put a little bit of salt on top of that. Okay, that is everything we have to do for the setup. Yep, that's salt. But now we have to wait. 10 seconds for the ice to melt and then refreeze to attach to our fishing line. So let's count out 10 seconds. One ice and salty, two ice and salty, three ice and salty, four ice and salty, five ice and salty, six ice and salty, eight ice and salty, nine ice and salty, ten ice and salty. Now we're ready. Lift your fishing line up gently. It looks like I got one, two, three. Oh, lost one. Uh, all right, one, two, three. I <laughs> lost another one. One, two, three, four. Well, four's not too bad. If you can do better than four, then nice job. For instructions on how to do this experiment and many more, check out our website, sciencefun.org. There you can also find science jokes and facts and information about our in-school field trips and camps at the lab. Hope to see you there. Bye.